Enter the captivating Karenverse, where everyday scenes morph into astonishing spectacles. Witness an insanely enraged Karen's thunderous baseball game outburst, crazy Karen's torrent of screams, an entitled Karen's room demand clash, a male Karen's store court threat, a satisfying Karen karma moment, shocking racism, and a roundup Karen's morning tirade. Immerse yourself in this curated Karen phenomenon for disbelief and amusement. Insanely enraged Karen yells during a baseball game and even her husband is clearly embarrassed by her behavior. Crazy Karen won't stop screaming at this poor woman who has clearly explained several times it's the machine that isn't working and not her fault. But is she listening? <laughs> you be the judge. I'm serious. Is there a problem with the machine? I'm yes, I already said that. There's a problem with the machine. It's not me. Well, well if there's a problem, we'll have to go somewhere else. So go somewhere else. It has my card, lady. It has all of my money in it. Goodbye. Have a wonderful well, day. It's not my problem. It's your problem. You're the one screaming at me first. The is no good. You don't have any money in there. It's the machine. It's have a wonderful day, Karen. Love you. I love you. Oh. Now I'm sitting here. Angry male Karen isn't happy that this guy is trying to live out his dream by busking in public and gives him a lecture right there and then. Angry male Karen makes me quit music forever. This is what I love in this time. He's got a good one. This guy's a musician. Have you got Instagram? Please, everyone unfollow me because I'm a bad singer. Go and follow this guy. Oh, do you want to promote yourself? Because I'm telling everyone to unfollow me. I'm going to quit music. I'm going to run a business right there. Obviously, that's my business. Well, that's what I'm saying. Promote it. Do you play guitar? Do you sing? Are you in a band? Music, rock music? Promote it. Well, you came here I'm looking for some busy. kind of attention. You want some No, no, I don't want any attention. I just want to stop hearing your horrible voice. It's not got a horrible voice, man. Uh, he has it, so I don't get why you're keeping it on. But he's doing something that me, he loves. Customers are asking me what chains they want. I'm asking what colours do they want. Yeah, yeah so but he's doing the, something that he loves. So other know. people have complained. It's not just me. They've complained as well. No, no. Oh, that's right. I mean, you literally finish it in 10 minutes. A male Karen. It's a Kevin. It's a Kevin. It's a Kevin. Entitled Karen wants to be personally escorted to her room to prove her point, but this employee is adamant she's wrong. Well, who do you think is right? When you encounter a Karen at work, yeah, Art. I want to speak to a manager. I am now. a manager, ma'am. Do what you gotta do. Okay, we can walk you up. Or I can no, call you're the not gonna and... walk me up to my room and show me my phone ma ma to prove to you that I have a reservation. Ma'am, you clearly stayed in the room past 5.30 last night. Yeah, I did, because I thought I had another... Notebooks. You never booked another one, ma'am. Yes, I did. Okay, so there's no issue. And then no you issue. want me to show there's... you proof? Yes, so I can see it because it's not in my system. And what if it's not in my phone? How would it not? How many hundreds of dollars do you want me to pay you to look in my phone, to go to my room and look in my phone? Ma'am, you Doesn't paid that seventy-five sound dollars bit... yesterday. Yeah. To stay until five thirty. You did not leave at five thirty. You did not make another reservation. I did pick a reservation. That's so that's, that's what I'm what saying. You're All you have on. to do is show you're me saying, the reservation, ma'am. All I'm asking is for you to show me the confirmation number. You're saying you're going to walk me to my room to show to have proof in my yes, phone. Yes, because if I don't see First the proof, all, I can't allow you to stay in that on. room. There's internet, ma'am. All you have to do is connect to the Wi-Fi. All right, let's go. Okay. Let's go. I, I tried to come down here to smoke a cigarette, but is this funny to you? I'm, am I laughing? 
I'm not laughing, man. I came out to smoke a cigarette, and now you're saying, get out of our hotel and provide me money. I didn't say man, that at she all. she didn't say that. that. That's what you're insinuating. You're going to go to my room. I'm making sure. Show proof. I'm making sure that you actually made a reservation, because I already caught you in one lie when you said that you spoke with a woman here. There's no other woman besides me that worked yesterday. I did speak with a woman. You couldn't have yesterday afternoon spoke with a woman, ma'am. That's impossible. You want to go to my room and look for proof? I'm not looking for doing? proof. All I said was show me the reservation, confirmation number that you made. You, just said that you, you said that you booked it on your phone. Yes. All you have to do is show me the email confirmation number so I can pull it up in the system and see where the res reservation is because I don't see it. But if I don't see proof of a new right, reservation and there's not one in let's my go. system, then I can't allow you to stay in that room, ma'am. So, okay, so now you're telling me that you're not going to allow me to stay in the room. If I don't have proof that you made another reservation to be in that room, yep, yep. then yes, ma'am. Yeah, yeah, you need to call somebody. Um, call, uh, no, 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 call. I'm not going to call nobody because yeah, I'm yeah, the manager, do. man. Yeah, you do. You're not going to tell me you're going up to my room and showing me proof. Ma'am, no. if you no, made no, a reservation, no, it shouldn't no, be that no, no, hard no, no, for you no, to no, give no, me no, the confirmation. No, 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 because that's what I'm about to do. Yeah, I'm just going to call the police to escort you out, ma'am. Okay. That's fine, because I can open the door so that you can get your things, but the police will come and escort you No, you're not even giving me that option. You're being like crazy. How am I doing? Ma'am, I'm You're like, you're not staying another night. Ma'am. I'm talking to you as calm as I can be. All I did was ask for proof of the reservation. You're being crazy. How? You're telling me that I have to get out of my room I right now? It was I didn't say. Right. Do you have proof of the reservation, ma'am? That's all I said. I don't know. You can go look at my phone. You can search. Do whatever you want to do. Ma'am. Search for what? All you have to do is pull it up. My phone isn't on. Just go. Just go to my It's just connected room. to the just internet. Go to my room. That's fine. I need to have a cigarette. If How you want to go search my room, you can't. I'm not searching your room, ma'am. All I need you to do is grab your phone and show me your confirmation number. It's not on. My phone is on. So let's go. So, ma'am, how did you book the reservation? You just said you booked it through I your phone. It. Yeah, I did it last okay, night. Okay, yeah. so all you have to do is show me the confirmation email that was sent to you. That's okay. it. If it's on there, that's fine. It's going, it should be in your email, ma'am. Okay. How the fuck do you Does this person work here? Yes, yes she I does. Is. Oh, okay. <sighs> yeah, I'm going outside. You can go to my room and search your phone. Male Karen threatens the store employee that he's going to take her and the entire store to court. Okay, Karen. You cannot deny access to a service dog. Like a manager coming it don't freaking matter. You're going to need to apologize to me. I'm not oh, you're going to because I will be bringing you to court and the store to court. You think it's a joke? You cannot deny me access to the freaking store. This is a full pledged service dog. Like, that's pretty bad. That's pretty freaking bad. I'm not a manager. Of course, you're not a manager. You're just the type of ignorant that's gonna deny people access. Crazy Karen attacks a group of teens with her trolley and won't stop harassing them. Get a life, Karen. This is a Karen. <laughs> Karen! You're filming me as well. We're going to Target as well. Oh my mom's right there. said that I wear, I was going there, now heading We're going to Target as well. You're a troublemaker. <laughs> Still following us. Really? Go that way yeah, or that way. This Karen's following us, us so Why? yeah. Following <laughs> Karen, good night. This is fun. It is. Karen Worker comes to continue their argument on this man's property and won't get off his drive so the man can leave in his car. All of this over the guy calling the worker's wife a Karen. They're a happy Karen couple, I guess. 
You want to, oh, I'm recording you too. I've been recording you. Okay, you want to call names and scream and act like a nothing that. No, let me do that. Oh, you're you over here using line? foul language about you need to leave now. Oh my god, foul get out language. of my driveway. Okay, Karen, get out of my Karen. driveway. Okay, get I live on the next street. out of my driveway. If you want to talk tough and act like get out of my something. driveway. Come out to the street. Could get out of my driveway. Your driveway. Get out of my driveway. Okay. What's your name? Don't worry about it. Okay, Tuffy. Okay, Tuffy yourself. I had you on video this whole time. Hey, the cops are coming to your house. Cops right. are coming to your house. Cops are coming to your house, buddy. Okay. Tell them to come to my house. I used to you don't pass. For you. you don't pass Man. on this street. I live in this neighborhood. You I'm don't pass on the road. Me. Your wife almost hit my daughter because she was trying to back in the driveway. Yeah, she, she was too close. The before even looking she, she, was she, too, was... she was too close. No. She didn't have a car lane. She when tried to pass. You were here. here. You make sure traffic's clear hey. before you stop and back and block traffic. Were you, you here? Fuck. Were you here? Were you here? League City PD is coming over to visit Okay, you. call them. You're going to be trespassed. Okay. And you're not going to be able to come call to my property again. I'm so sorry. You're going to have that on your name. I'm so sorry. It's so funny how you're so tough in front of an eight-month-old pregnant woman. Donald? Yeah. What? Is that your name? It says David. David. Okay. All right. You want to yell at my wife again? Come nobody yell at me. Nobody yelled at nobody. You think she's lying? Come on, crying for no reason? Nobody yelled at nobody, bud. Okay. I got I little girls. I know where you live. I you got figure out why I live, buddy. I ain't scared of you. Oh, then that's why you won't come out in the street, huh? I don't need to. Because you're in, oh, because why? You're, you you're not on my property. Property, bro. The kind of man who will yell at a woman. He yelled at nobody. Hey, got cameras. Drive. Nobody yelled at anybody. Okay. I said, ma'am, okay. you don't pass. Okay. You don't pass. And okay. then she started yelling at me. Okay. And I said, bye, Karen. Okay. I'm sorry you have problems. Oh, Hope wish you, you happiness. Apparently. I'm sorry your daughter don't know how to drive either. What's sorry, your name? You wanted, I get it. She's your family. You want to defend her? I didn't defend anybody. Okay. Okay. You That's don't know because you weren't story. here. Cool. You weren't here. Okay. You don't know. I was right around the corner. Go home talk to your tough. wife. Somebody come talk tough to me. Go home to your you wife. You want to talk tough here? That's fine. Come to my house and talk tough. Go home to your wife. I don't wife. know who I'm messing with, right? Go I don't home. know who I'm messing with. Go home to your wife. Have a good day, sir. Yeah. Karen tried to cut in front of this woman's client while at the Target, but this woman is not here for this kind of entitlement and puts this Karen back in her place. This so Karen tried to cut my client in me. line at you Target. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. I want and the back police up. right here now. And back up. And this is all on video. I didn't do anything wrong. Exactly. Because you thought you were going to get in front of me. Exactly. Who are you talking to? You. You're not talking to me. <laughs> I am trying to make a return here. Like. And that's exactly what I'm when doing. So why do you think you're so entitled? You thought you were going to come and stand in front of me? And then I correct you about what you did. You thought you were going to come and get in my face. We're not I'm doing not that today. Face. You did get in my face. I and know. I got it on video. Stop Whatever. playing with me. Stop playing with me. Okay. I was here Thank first. I came the correct way, like Whatever. all customers should. Just get done. She jumped. I'm not talking to you. She jumped in front of me. And this young lady knows she came from this way. And then she said, well, I have a return. Ma'am, I'm already standing right here. Just get it over with. Right. Wait, you made a big deal about it. No, I didn't. Yes, you did. You did. Now stop playing with me. For real. I can take over here. Last morning, lady. Really good. Last morning. Refund $31.59. Okay. You, you need my card? card? Do you want it back on your debit card? You can give it to me in cash. Cash? Yeah. yeah. Um, we're done. Mm -hmm. Can you reset that one? The one here. Yeah, I put the two. You got the right one here. today. Racist Karen continues her insults even when called out directly, and now she's being filmed. The most blatant kind of racism is often the most disgusting. You should be sorry for yeah. that. You're in Canada. Hey, Speak English. Take a picture. Dad, look at this. Take five of them. I'll pay you 50 bucks for the picture. Learning. Where's your FaceTime? Look at, no, look at this. Learn English. Look at this. Look at this. Learn English. Learn English, por favor. I know how to speak English. Dad, speak it. Yes, what do you want to say? I want to say, what? please speak English, you gorgeous. I know how to speak English. Then, then no, it's fine, English. baby. Yeah. We're good, we're here. You know this? Huh? 
We're just walking around here and she just came in. Uh, I'm in a mood. Yeah. Why, 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 not, why not minding you? Please call the cops. I can't even see your face. Girl, we're just minding our please. business. Please. Please call the cops. I'll give you 50 bucks to call the cops right now. You don't belong in our country. Take some FaceTime. Take some FaceTime. She's a gorgeous girl and this is your fault. No, it's not. That's okay. Are you kidding me? You just hurt your own child. Stay away from us. What is wrong with you? Can you speak English? Say it again. 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 Crazy Karen is riled up and yells uncontrollably at this poor girl who is completely overwhelmed with her racism and aggression, especially since it's only 10 a.m. All of a sudden you can talk, take my picture. Who paid for that? You can't afford that, but you can afford that. You don't have to go through those kind of questions. It's 10 a.m. <laughs> I don't understand your aggression. No, it's not aggression. It's a question. That's aggressive. You want me to call the police on you? Why? All I did is ask you if you paid for it. I heard it's free. No, yes I did. I don't understand. Oh, so you now, finally you say you paid for it. And I, you, you clarified something. I did two minutes ago. Oh, you're very articulate. You did understand English. <laughs> Do you understand other languages? Oh, what? You don't want to have a congenial conversation? What is wrong with you? Nothing's wrong with me. <laughs> You make funny faces though, like something might be wrong with you. I don't get... Why are people so You're mean? You're free to cry here. Yeah. Oh, so you pay for it, but they pick on me. Her. I pay for mine. I pay for mine too, and they pick her. on me. Yeah, they blame me. Why don't they pick on you? Oh, you're going to cry about having to pay? You can, you can cry in public about paying. I... In your own name. And everything? Of course I do. I did. pay too. Why are you being like this? I'm sick of paying for others that don't pay and they double on us. Get us. Yeah, well, it's the same sort of intrusion, isn't it? You don't have to. You're just dying for a confrontation. Oh, you love your starring role, don't you? You want to make us the villain. Oh, you make us pay. You don't want people that pay. You want you want it for free. There's no record of paying for their bastards. Car Karen thinks her insults prove that she is right. Think again, Karen. You don't know how to drive. You're ugly. Oh god, ooh. This is going right to the leasing office. What? This is going right to the leasing office. The racist Karens are out in the troves today. And this clip features a racist Karen couple. You gotta love racism in Union. Karens can't read my company labeled shirt and hat. Off of my driveway, young man. You are I'm, on, I'm on a public street. You guys cannot say the N-word, man. That's kind of rude. You still can't say those rude words. Just because that just because you have a son of, of color. Please leave my property. You are in violation. You are still on my property line, sir. My property line is over here. Do you see what where the grass meets? For? What is your name? I'm on, I'm on a public street. What company you, you do you can't, work you for? Can't, you can't make me do anything. I can ask you what company you work for. I don't want to tell you anything. Yeah, because you know I'm going to call your boss exactly. and complain what about boss? it. What boss? What boss? Tell me who you work for. <laughs> no. What? This guy is fed up seeing this worker harass innocent shoppers and calls him out directly, resulting in the woman he was currently harassing profusely thanking him for helping her. Showing how distressing his behavior was. Dumb Karen. Was that lady harassing you? Yes. What's Thank up? You. Why, why are you always harassing people? Thank That's you. That's not your job. Thank That's you. That's not your job. Thank you know that, right? Thank What's your name? Huh? What's your name? What's your name? Donna. Donna? Thank how long you have you been so working much. here? Huh? How long have you been working here? Somebody else. So why? 
Exactly. It's not, it's not your job, though. It's not your receipt. job. I don't okay, have to Okay, well, you why we got self checkouts then? Exactly. I got hire more cashiers. Yes. <laughs> That's the we're not about to wait all day for y'all. Exactly. So it's not your job also to follow a person it's too, you know not. that, right? It's not. it's not your job to follow a person it's not. out. It's you know not that, right? Your job is reported. No, I read all about it, and yes, I can follow her. Okay, Donna. No, all right. Follow all right. I got no, 15,000 followers on TikTok, Donna. Everyone about to see this bull. Thank you. Of course. Karen didn't want to sell this couple wine, and so the manager was called to try and resolve this issue. Will the Karen cave? Sell this couple wine so my wife and the manager got her together. You know, it's up, it's up to the cashier to if you think we've been drinking, we're not supposed to sell it to you because it's against the federal law. Well, 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 I can't smell because, um, because they know about it's not close enough to you, but. That name fits up. Look at her name. All right, look. It okay, is $20 and 94 cents. Okay. 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 That's bullshit. I've never heard that in my life. Not what? I feel a little bit what? About having a bad day, y'all. A long day. It's not a long day, but it means she didn't want to sell them liquor because she said that they've been drinking already. I've been working for the last four weeks at Cypress Lane. And you had a bad day? Drunk or drinking too much? Well, I was just saying. Come on, baby. That was rude. Yeah, really? She was rude. I'm sorry. I don't, I'm not trying to be rude. How did you make that assumption now? Because um, it was the way they were acting. It was the way they were acting. But it was, it was, that's what all cancer was supposed to do. It's because it's federal law. It has nothing to do with What's federal law? I feel or not. But if you didn't detect alcohol from them, like how are they supposed to act? Is there a certain etiquette for Walmart? Well, Let's just do this. Let's just, okay, what are we doing here? Part two. Part to Karen refused to sell a cup of wine, and my wife and her supervisor got her together. Like, that was rude. Now, I don't think Walmart's going to determine who's drunk and who isn't. If you haven't done a blood breathalyzer, or took any hair or blood samples. So And you're not three, you're not authorized to do any of those things. Poor customer service. I just told them that I thought they were the hits. The way they were acting, they were acting like they had been drinking a little bit too much. They were having a conversation amongst themselves. Okay. And I, you know, because they wanted me to check them out. And originally I wanted them to start acting that right way. I thought they would say they had been drinking a little too much. And you know that during the, in the CBL, as well for our liquor license, we had, if they think somebody is drinking too much, we By have the way, they said if you smell alcohol, okay, then my apologies. I did not, I was told that if they were acting a certain way as well, that's my apologies. What is the certain way to act? Walmart. That's, that's what I'm oh yeah, that's how I came out the window. Well, I'm sorry. Yeah, go take a break. I do apologize. I mean, I don't mean anything biased. I don't. I was just trying to take my liquor life. We have every, every cashier here has liquor life. Okay, so the question is, how are you to act in Walmart in order to buy liquor? Well, you're not wrong. <laughs> I mean, you know, 
How are they acting? Give me one second. One second. We get some I do apologize. Look, I, I mean, you know, I sold it to them, you know, and I, and I do apologize. I do. You know, I get a lot. Of, I get a lot of trouble because of my name, and I'm like sorry and you for that. Up, you live up to it. No, I don't. That was no, definitely no, a right? No, no, that was not. definitely no, a caramel. No, 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 no,